All right, welcome to Meadows Investment Forum backstage interview. We have here Roger Moss from Labrador Gold. Welcome, Roger. Thanks, Chan. It's good to be back. All right, great. So uh, we have a lot of uh, questions from the audience we were not able to cover uh, because of technical difficulty. I apologize for that. So first was, uh, you know, uh, you must want to know when do you expect to get a permit for this uh, crucial drilling you have for this uh, big vein? You were talking about the new discovery area. Yeah, well, it's, uh, it's been quite a wait and it is, uh, it, it is frustrating. Um, it's a question that I get asked a lot. And um, all, all I can say is, is, is we're still waiting, but there is some light at the end of the tunnel. Uh, the last I heard, um, we're waiting for the go-ahead from the Department of Fisheries and Oceans, and that should be the last, uh, the last department that we need to get the green light from. So um, it has been a long process, and, uh, but I think, I think we're getting close to the end. Okay, you have any kind of expectation this month or next month or, uh, you know, or something? Well, in terms of the permits, I, 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 I expect it to be done relatively soon. Um, and then, you know, yeah, I mean, I, 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 I don't want to put a specific date on it, but mm -hmm. I'm very happy if we got it this week. And if not this week, then next week. Um, that's, um, you know, that's, that's out of my hands. Yeah, absolutely. The government bureaucrat. So the, uh, well, but when you drill, right. So you, you see visible gold on, on the surface. So when you drill, uh, how soon can you get the results out? Or you, maybe you can, uh, some company to drill, they see a lot of VG. They, they just put a picture on their website. Say, Hey, we hit. So well, what's your, <laughs> Well, what's your plan uh, for, for this important, very important, because right next to a new fungo, right, that they they have a very big discovery there. Yeah, I mean, it, and, and they put out more, another news release today with some more exceptional intersections at, uh, at the Keat zone. Um, they're just, uh, they're just driving right on ahead. So it, that's good to see. Um, and absolutely, once, once we get started drilling, I mean, we're, go, we're going to really hone in on that area around the, um, around the visible gold occurrence. And uh, as you said, that, that occurrence is on surface. We expect to uh, see it below surface as well in, in the big vein. Um, and, you know, if, if, if we see visible gold in the core, I believe that, that that would be a material event that we would want to let our shareholders know about. And so uh, we, would, we would certainly have that, um, we would certainly put that out as a news release with, with the appropriate photos, of course. <laughs> Great. How many holes do you plan to drill? Uh, how many pads are you uh, applying for the permit? So what's, what's your plan? Or from the new fungo, do you have the idea of the angle uh, where to drill because uh, next to you, right? Yeah, so uh, let's, let's start at the beginning. Our, our, our permit application was for 43 holes, 10,000 meters. Um, I believe we're looking at uh, doing those from nine, nine different drill pads along the strike of uh, Big Vane. And we're planning to cover a 350 meter strike length of Big Vane. Initially, we're going to, as I said, really hone in on that area around, around the visible gold occurrence, because really, as we know from, from, uh, newfound gold, uh, you have to first get a sense of the plunge of this mineralization before you can do wider step out. So we, go, we are going to take a similar approach to newfound gold in terms of uh, drilling fairly close spacing around the visible gold occurrence, just to, just to get confidence in how the, the vein and the gold mineralization is plunging. Once we have that confidence, we'll be able to step out to the north and south on bigger, bigger step outs. And um, we don't, you know, we, we're the the area of the visible gold. I, I can't remember offhand how far it is, but it's probably about say 
five kilometers from from the lotto zone. So um, I don't think we can really we can really uh, expect that the that big vein would be doing the same kind of uh, have the same kind of orientation as as lotto or Keats. So it's it's something that we'll need to determine for ourselves. Okay. Well, good, good. Well, so if you have found any discovery, you know, uh, how how soon, how much you're going to plan to ramp up, and then do you have enough capital to support this uh, expanded drilling program? Yeah, I, I think if if we have a discovery, we'll certainly we'll certainly want to ramp up. Uh, we'll probably add a, another drill rig right away, um, and uh, we'll. Um, We'll probably apply for more permits along strike of Big Bang. And uh, in terms of the funding, uh, we have uh, we have more than enough funding funds in, in in hand to to I would say double or maybe even triple the ten thousand meters that were that were planned originally. Well, good. Well, just remind our viewers that the last round funding, uh, they were investor of New Fund Gold actually asked you to, to put money into your company. Is that right? Uh, yeah, that's right. We had a we had an unsolicited offer from Palisades Gold Corp uh, to uh, to uh, take take part or, or or to do a financing with uh, with us and. Um, we decided to go ahead with that because that was back in, I think it was August, September, and we, we still weren't sure of how COVID was going to play out. And uh, that was before the vaccines were sort of um, rolled out. So um, we, we decided that it was best to be cashed up um, when we could get the cash in order that we wouldn't be facing uncertainty down the road. And I think that um, looking back, that was probably a good call. Oh, very smart. So that will fund you for the foreseeable future this year for, for the drilling and then lab work and so on and so forth. So that's very good. And then there's the same investor of the new fund gold actually knocking on your door last year, late last year to, to put money in you. To become yeah, well, I like, I, I, I like to think that they, they, they like what they see happening at new fund gold and they, um, they wanted to, uh, to, to have a, a stake in Labrador gold as well. And um, because, you know, as, as we've said, we're a long strike, we're on the same structure. And uh, with, the, um, with the discovery of the visible gold, I think we have a very good chance for, uh, for something special. Excellent, excellent. So just to summarize, so you can may get a permit, lucky, we're lucky this week, next week, uh, if we're lucky, but again, it's in garments hand. So then when will you start drilling? If you start, for example, you get it next week, can you drill, start drilling um, very soon? Where, how, how, how rapidly do you plan to start a drilling program? We're, we're looking at about a two week, two week uh, startup. So when, once we get the permits, it'll probably be two weeks. So um, before we start, start drilling, uh, that's just uh, for mobilization and getting getting things organized. I mean, we have we have got a lot of um, a lot of preparation done already, but um, I'm I'm very hopeful that we'll be drilling before the end of the month. Great. So, do you have any sense of turnaround lab time for them from the lab? Uh, you know, because I heard in yeah. from other companies they they got back up. Um, uh, oh, from- the labs the labs are so backed up. I I think they're I think they're working flat out. And um, in fact, I, I, I read recently that, that one, one uh, BC lab is, is sending samples to Peru uh, because, <laughs> because they can't handle them in, in, in Vancouver. So um, we, we send all our samples to uh, Eastern Analytical in Newfoundland. Um, I've talked to the people there and they're, they're saying that uh, they're currently looking at 68 week turnaround. So, um, you know that's unfortunate. It's uh, it's a long time to wait when you when you're drilling the, your holes. But um, you know, hopefully, we'll find VG and we'll know if we hit before getting the assays back. Yeah, that will be the 
the target uh, you know we were looking for. So you, if you start drilling by the end of the month, and you can potentially next month you can report VG for for their shareholder. Right? That's where <laughs> people are waiting that, for. That would that would be the best case scenario for sure. All right, great. Thank you, Roger. Good luck. It's a, it will be a could be a transformational year for when for Labrador. So I hope you have uh, you know consistent results. Which most people expecting that the new fund go, but it's a very nice and fat interception. Thanks, Jan. I think uh, yeah, I think it's going to be an exciting year for us, and um, really looking forward to getting those drills in the ground. All right. Good luck. Thank you.